buns and bread in the oven. So that took me about five minutes. Back up here, I was debating if I should just go sit down. But I'm not going to. I'm going to power through. I'm going to spend an hour doing a real quick little tidy. Here's what we're doing with our power hour. First things first. I'm going to turn this back on. You in there. Okay, so we still have to clean up some dinner. But before we do that, I have leftover gravy here. Okay, and what I'm going to do is just make a very quick um, stock slash base for a chicken. This is just a leftover gravy from dinner. And I just added about half a cup of flour and maybe a cup of water. I also added a vegetable cube. You could add whatever flavor you want. I just chose especially veggie because that's what I had sitting out. Um, chicken that's left over from dinner tonight. We had a whole chicken. The other thing I'm going to do that will help to thicken my base is just throw these leftover potatoes in. One last thing to have to clean up. Okay, I'm happy with that. So we are 10 minutes into our four hour. We have bread in the oven. We have leftovers ready to go in the fridge for tomorrow. Well, not quite in the fridge, but we have a head start on dinner for tomorrow. Hello, everybody, and thank you for joining me today for our Power Hour to-do list hosted by Jessica over at Jessica Myros. I'm going to link her channel in the description box down below as well as the group playlist so you can check out and see what other things are happening for our Power Hour. So we are having a, you know, kitchen cleanup at the end of the day. Like I said, I didn't really want to do this, but I thought... You know what? I'm just going to do it. I managed to get the kitchen tidied up. We got bread cooked, or bread was rising at this point, um, and then baked. It only takes about half an hour, give or take, depending on the temperature of your kitchen, to get it to rise up to the perfect spot to be able to bake it. Um, and I got the bathroom done. So, I mean, you know what? Sometimes it really just pays off to set that clock, set your timer, and get it done. It doesn't have to be an hour either. Like, if you need 15, if you just want to give yourself 15 minutes and say, okay, I got a 15-minute timer set, um, and see what you can get done in that 15 minutes, um, whatever. But I was happy to get this done. And I'm going to throw some music on for you, let you listen to it. And I just want to say thank you for being here. I really appreciate you. And it is day five of vlogmas so i am happy um to see you hopefully you're not getting sick of me yet
15 minutes left on our hour, our power hour. See what kind of trouble we can get into. This currently is apparently being used as garbage. Wide screen. Just fix this. Um, okay. And then we're just gonna come in here and pick up garbage off the floor, candy canes. Oh my. Okay. You're in a little bit closer than you probably would have liked to, I bet. I don't know what it is with these kids and toilet paper. I just wanted to say, I think they, I don't know, it's really frustrating. I go in, every time I go into the kitchen, there is toilet paper, the kitchen. Every time I go in the bathroom, there is toilet paper on the floor. I believe it is my three-year-old. I've tried putting it away, but then the problem is nobody can reach the toilet paper when it's time to go to the bathroom. So I'm working on that solution. But generally, every time I go in the bathroom, there's toilet paper on the floor. It's annoying. <laughs> I could still do it's better than when I started that's the goal quick in quick out the big thing for in here was just this wall because my boys two of them are you know they're learning how to pee apparently so they like to pee on the wall they don't pee it's the little one I caught him the other day he comes in and he stands here and shoots this way and doesn't always watch what he's doing but I also think it's the older one that just doesn't care the middle one but whatever cleaner than it was let's go check on our bread All right guys, thanks for joining me for a power hour to-do list. Don't forget to check out our host, Jessica Myros, and the playlist down in the description box as well. Um, we even had time to bake bread and buns in our hour, because remember, we started it just at the beginning. I let it rise, this probably, let it rise, sorry, this probably could have gone a little bit longer. And this is my sourdough sandwich bread over here. Oops. Let's see. This is my sourdough sandwich bread. Um, it's so soft, look at it, so soft. So soft, okay, and then this is regular sour, uh, sandwich bread. Um, it'll soften up as it sits, and then we've got buns over here as well. That way I don't have to make them for, so, oops, I'm covering you up. So like I said, thanks for joining me guys, and I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 6.